Hey everybody, Dave here. This is part one of our new series, Cheese Review. I came up with the idea myself. There's this, there's this guy on the internet, Sam, I think his name is Sam the Dungus or something. I don't know. And he's trying to market. This is his big thing. And I'm here to show you that I was born ten days before him, and that I can do it better. This is a true fact. Source in the description below. We're gonna be starting this with a little bit of a palate cleanser today. We have. Seagram's Canadian whiskey. I, I don't know. It, it put hair on my chest when I was 15. It'll probably do it now. Get myself nice and clean, nice and ready for the cheese. God bless. Now, today we're reviewing Great Lakes American cheese. Now, I know there's going to be haters down below. You know, it's not technically a cheese unless it's 51% cheese and the nutrition facts, and that's true. And that's true. But we live in a world where Bruce Jenner is woman of the year. And so, if this is fucking cheese, then it is. Pardon my friend. We got Great Lakes American cheese. You can see solid consistency. You can tell it's uh, very natural. You can tell it's all in, you can tell it's all natural. It looks really natural, if I had to put it into words. But I can't really put it into words, I can only put it into tongue, which is why I'm going to be partaking in this cheese. One minute, 54 seconds in, according to my timer. Alright, eight more minutes and we'll get some revenue. See how slowly I can chew it. We're going in for the money shot. M -m 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 money shot, we got Great Lakes American cheese. And we're landing. Mm. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know, I've had Great Lakes American cheese before. I worked in the cheese industry for a few years, actually. I mean, it's always kind of been a C-tier American cheese. If you take into consideration that there is no A-tier American cheese, you can only have a good, a somewhat decent American cheese. It's not up there with, like, feta. You're talking to a Greek boy right here. So, feta, obviously, S plus tier. The best American cheese you're going to get is probably an A tier. Maybe Land Lakes, Deets and Watson. Um, Great Lakes will always be the worst American cheese. That's kind of what I'm trying to say. But, I mean, other than that, I'm enjoying this shit. I'm not, I don't really have any complaints. Other than that, it's a C tier fruit. Uh, yeah, that's about it. Good cheese. I give it a C tier rating. 7 out of 10 as far as American cheese goes. 10 being still subpar, but the best for American cheese. Yeah. Yeah, I guess that was all. I'll see you guys next time. Dave the Dingus, new videos every Monday. I love you. Sam, I'm watching you, and I know you're watching me. Give it a like, give it a thumbs up, and, uh, We'll see you next time. This has been Dave the Dingus Cheese Review.